Hi and welcome to a new league today. We are playing the One Ring Dot X deck, and yeah, this is just thrown with new cards. We are playing So in Mike Spawn. We are playing Cosmex Command, a really good card. The Power of Destiny, Yugin's Labyrinth, and all those crazy good cards from Modern Horizon 3. This list is not mine. Got a really good result, and I want to try it. I think that Tron right now is really, really powerful. And without further ado, let's jump into a league okay yeah sure why not we're going to keep this in slavery in turn one into talisman of resilience into turn two the one ring yeah just like that should he play Ooh, that's a good card that's actually a good card i don't know i feel like they could have a counter spell like a spell pierce but let's try to go for the one ring i think it's the strongest player and if this resolves we we just win turn to the one ring seems really powerful we almost have unlimited mana unlimited cards in hand what could go wrong yeah they just conceded turn to one ring seems to be too powerful i think i'm not going to side in anything this is looking fine we have the karn sideboard so yeah just going to submit like this i'm not going to keep this hand Where's the temple? Yeah, this is looking a bit better. I'm going to bottom again. Well, let's go for... Where's my expedition map? Oh, okay. Turn one, consign to memory. Okay. Where's the temple into talisman into expedition map? Go. They missed the land drop. That's not good, my friend. So should I go for Micah Spawn? I could also just crack map. We're going to do this play. Our little dude that's going to get us a land. And we are getting a tower. Then we crack expedition map. We get remaining Tron piece and that's game. I'm going to do that now because they have consigned to memory. And we are missing power plant. Go. And they pass the turn once again. Hey, command. Sure, why not? Let's try to get Karn into play. Okay, what should we get then? I kind of want... In the One Ring, Sundering Titan, we have 5, 6, 7 mana. I think I'm just going for the One Ring. It's a bit boring, I know, but it's the One Ring. You can never go wrong. And I'm just going to pass a turn. Yeah, they kill Karn, that's okay. Got another one. I kind of want to go for K Command. Oh, they could have Blood Moon. Now they have a Flage. We have protection though, so they kind of have to, I don't know, they're going to Elix the Flage. Elix, it's okay. Okay, um... Okay, uh, I think we are just going to win the game next turn. Make a bunch of dudes. I cannot target myself. That's true. No! <laughs> I cannot target myself. Okay. That's fine. Okay, and that, that was good. So we go for Karn. Minus. Sundering Titan win the game. Okay, they just conceded. Sure. So what do we have here? I think that this is a key because we have Devour. Um, yeah. That was a turn one, I guess. So we are facing buzzing thing. Uh, is that thing called? Yeah, whatever. So we kind of want the expedition map, right? The current is going to be kind of good, but they have some unblockable creatures that we need to kill as soon as possible. And their Blood Fountain. Okay, Mox Ember and the Kappa. Okay, I cannot kill it. Power ago. And another one? Oh, shoot. <laughs> uh, the deck seems, I don't know, bad and good at the same time. I mean, we're just dead next turn. And I cannot really do anything unless I draw like exactly. Or just mine into all this dust. I'm not going to kill that thing. Oof. Okay. Never mind. This is still a one ring deck. 
Okay, interesting. We just need to loop a couple of one rings and we're going to be fine. Emery. Okay, nothing too good in their graveyard. Their last card is yours. And we are looking for the one ring, all this dust plus which is mine. They kept the card on top. Okay. Power plants. Stop giving me power plants, please. Okay, we got another one ring. <laughs> This is so dumb. Uh, yeah, just going to play another one ring. I could have, yeah, playing this land was not the best idea. Not that it changes too much, because even if I get mine, two mana are not good enough. So we're going to dismember Tamiya, right? Yeah, I feel like Tamiya is the scariest one, but Emery is also really, really scary. Now let's kill the Emery. The one ring, what a card. Another Kappa Cannoneer. They're kind of wasting resources because they already add lethal. So by doing these, they are just going to lose even harder to an all this dust. That was not a great play. They could have a counter spell in their hand. That's true. Please give me mine. Where are you? Okay. Okay, that's good. That's good. So I want Karn into play. Let's go. Minus. Get one ring. I don't think we have anything better. We have Oblivion Stone. We actually have Oblivion Stone. Now, I think that the one ring is... Oblivion Stone, though, is really, really good. Oh, whatever, let's get Oblivion Stone. It's true that if they have a counter, they are going to counter the Oblivion... We cannot activate the Oblivion Stone. What am I thinking? Yeah, the one ring. <laughs> counter. Ooh, they have sink into stupor. Uh, yep, they won. That was kind of interesting. Sure, good game. I'm thinking I'm going to side in a wire might instead of one of the slower cards, maybe. Mine, power plant, tower, key. Uh, what do we want? Top not seer or K command? I think K command. Where's this mine? Go. And I'm just going to fetch a forest. They could have break the ice. Let's not break the ice. Um, yeah. And let's exile Bazim. Let off denial. Yeah. So they have a lot of counter spells, Emery. So I think I'm just going for Micah Spawn. I'm going to Exile Sewers. Do they have another counter spell? I mean, I kind of hope so, unless it's a concern to memory, because you want to be able to go Coslex command on the Emery. Okay, let's go for... I'm going to Exile the Emery, that's for sure. Do I want to make Dudes or draw cards? I think I want to draw a card. I think I want Karn. Okay. Pithy Needle. The one ring. Uh, okay. So I go for Labyrinth. No. And then I want to cast Ulamog this turn, but what am I getting? This two or two lands? What if I go for Karn? I could just go Karn into Oblivion Stone for free. Yeah, I could. Maybe it's better. Yeah, let's try. Where is the Oblivion Stone? I'm going to do that now because I am scared of consigned to memory. Okay, that was a good turn. Okay. We can go Talisman and two more. We're going to excite these and doors we won nice uh yeah sure why not Ooh, okay i'm looking for a wire might uh world breaker seems okay but we have thought not seer with double drudzy temple so i think it's a bit better Pithing needle expedition mob okay sure we have counter counter spring leaf drum Counter, counter. Uh, pa, pa, pa. I think I'm going to take Metallic Rebuke. Yeah. Because 
Cosmix command is an instant, so we are just going to do that in their turn while they are topped out. And we have two big creatures into our hand. Another pithy needle. Stop the one ranger. Final play team. That's kind of scary. Good forest. I'm just going to play tower and I'm going to talk. I think I'm just going for K command. Yeah, I think so. And I'm looking for power plant. This is not power plant, but it's close enough, I think. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep both. I mean, this turn we are going to get rid of a bunch of plants, run a lot of mana. I think this is going to be a really good turn. Let's cast it with Kicker. Sile, these were the saga. So what do we get? Power plant? Yeah, power plant is fine. Getting Boseju and another land was also fine, but I think that I am okay doing this. Okay, so they have force and a big construct. I think that this game is over. Where is this mine? Four, eight. I'm thinking about going for another Micah spawn first. Because I could go Micah spawn, but I'm losing one mana. No, I think that this is fine. We're going to get to excel that one and final plating, maybe. They have a lot of unblockable creatures and kind of scared. Yeah. Okay, your turn. Okay, good game. If we just got Devourer, uh, but I'm missing the land. It's unlikely for me to miss the land drop completely, so I think I should keep. Because if I find something like Yugin's Labyrinth, this is going to be really, really good. Or the mirror match. Okay, Frazzy Temple. Yeah, I think I could still keep a land on top. Or is this mine? Okay. Let's temple, then we go Talisman, then I play another expedition map and your turn. So this turn we go, yeah, we're getting with this tower, we play the tower, we pass the turn. And I could go for K command, but I think I'm just going to grab the missing throne piece. So we're missing the mine. We need a good payoff though. I mean... K command obviously really really good so I'm going to do that because they cannot really play a devourer they have their own devourer so they're just going to kill mine and we know about that one sure they go for a map so I'm looking for Ulamog I'm just going to make a bunch of dudes and draw a card I don't care about this construct barn okay he wire mine interesting sure okay there it is so i'm just going to i think i should probably do something like these one green bottom and then top 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 the attack we take two so we play with this power plant two four and we're are missing four mana and now we exile tower karn now i play the one ring i draw one and now we play this little dude with kicker and the game should be over i mean this was such a powerful turn he command once again win the game yeah it was just game all this dust not good in this matchup I think I'd rather have a Cityscape Leveler, probably. Stone Brain might be good, but maybe Might is better. I'm not too sure about that, honestly. I mean, all these cards are actually good against them, right? Let's just cut this member as well. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Okay, this is looking good. Yeah. So we are looking for a world breaker, maybe? Because I'm going to play Yugin's Labyrinth into Talisman of Resilience. Maybe another mic spawn is fine. Yeah, that could be... I could even get another Yugin's Labyrinth. I mean, that's, that's fine as well. Yeah, whatever, let's go for a Labyrinth. One ring, nah, whatever. It's, it's okay. They're kind of slow, they're not doing much over there. I think Talisman and cards like that helps us a lot. So this turn it should go again Labyrinth and then we make a bunch of dudes draw a card. I think it's what I'm going to do. 
Is really next turn I can just go mic spawn? Sure. Stone Brain. What are they going to name? Karn? Choose a card name. I should go for K command right now. And let's go for K command. We've got our own Stone Brain. Yeah, I think I kind of like Stone Brain. I think that they're going to name Karn. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. So we got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So close. So we cast this one with Kicker. Let's get rid of the Labyrinth. Now I'm getting a mine. Do I care about stone braining now? I don't think so. I mean, it's fine to just cast the stone brain, but I don't think I need to actually activate stone brain. They're kind of behind. Even if they go one ring, we have Ulamog, so yeah, that's okay. Where's this mine? Are you just passing the turn like that? I, I, you're kind of dead. How much mana do they have? 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 14. I guess we're going to cast Thought Not Seer first. They have a lot of things, I guess. <laughs> uh, you're so dead. Yep, one and two. See ya. Good game. Oh, we're against True Hero. Uh, yeah, this is probably keep. Now yeah, let's keep. And let's crack expedition map. I'm just getting a tower. Your turn. We have the one ring next turn, which is going to be kind of good against a black deck, unless they have an early shield dread or anything like that. Profane Tutor Exiled, yeah, sure, whatever. Okay, we have a lot of one rings. Talisman, sure. Make for a dominance. I think I'm just going to loop a bunch of one rings already. Oh, we got Tron though. Uh, I'm not too sure about this. I think I should go for Talisman. And then another one ring. I don't want them to go Soul Spike, all those cards. Yeah, they go Soul Spike now, sure. Okay, and we're going to win next turn. Go! I mean, even if they go Shield Dread, they're going to draw a lot of cards, but then they have only five cards remaining. We go Ulamog, get rid of these two, or all these dust and whatever. The one bring. Okay. So let's see, the Exile, Necrodominance. Okay. Six, seven, eight, and ten. One and two away. I'm just going to draw two cards here. Talisman. Do I want another talisman? I think so. Yeah, whatever. Go. They already used one soul spike, so it's unlikely for them to just kill me here. Thought seize. Yeah, sure. Your dread. Uh, okay. And they just dead. So if we go for Eldrazi Temple, we can attack, we could just devour these, how much money do you have? I don't know, I think I'm just supposed to attack. Mm, that's interesting. No, they could have... Uh, okay, let's go for... For mana, I thought not seer, 6, 7, 8, yeah. They could have a soul spike and survive here. They have two soul spike. Okay, okay. Yup. And the game's over. So one stone brain. I think this member is fine. Obviously they have the combo with the shield red that we need to get rid of. I don't think I need a word breaker. Might seem okay. Instead of all this dust. Do they keep something like these? It's not really good. 
whatever. I think I think it's fine. We're going to ramp up mana. If they go turn one discard spell, I mean, I cannot really aim to something better. We have mana ramp, which is the best thing to have against discard spells. Okay, go. So they could have break the eyes, which is fine. Void walk here. <laughs> Void walker. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, nothing to be worried about. We've got this member. We dodge the scariest threat here. Nick for dominance, that's okay. Double profane tutor gone. Uh, this is labyrinth is not doing much. So I have three mana, four with the signet, six with temple, eight with the other temple. I think I should go for display and hopefully draw something like mine and if i draw mine we kind of win because we already have double tower obviously if they go for children now it's kind of scarier they still have five cards at best in their hand i don't really care about their life total it's also true that playing Ugin's labyrinth yeah if i went Ugin's labyrinth pitching ulamog i could have protected and it was a bit better break the ice okay fine. i mean nothing would have changed because they could have now nah, it's not true that was the wrong choice Well, not seer that's a cute card I'm going to take the shield bread <laughs> so they're just going to play grief they go down to two they're looking for soul spike yeah there it is and they pitched make for dominance bogger okay we don't know their hand right now expedition map and let's get another power plant for Borg. Okay. And that's game, sure. Break the Ice is a bad card, but when you just overload, the effect is just great, obviously. Use this and good enough. It's kind of okay. And I think I should keep. Surveil land, surveil away a March Plus. Plus Temple. I think I'm just going to do this and pass the turn. This way they cannot play Voidwalker. Sure. So we want to exile target creature. We have four. I think I want a couple of dudes here. Pretty draw. Let's. I think I want mana. Uh, yeah, I think that I'm going to play Thought Not Seer though. Soul Spike the Thought Not Seer. Yep. Wow, they have nothing. Oof. That's so good. Okay, go. We play Urborg. Bogart. Sure. Tower. I want them to excel my map because they can get it back with Karn. Another temple. What should they get? Let's see. Map? Do we get the map back? I mean, sure, whatever. I'm just going to block, obviously. We didn't know about that one. <laughs> oh, we just like that? Okay. Sure. Uh, what is the best thing we can get from the Karn board? A big Ballista? Yeah, whatever. Let's get a big Ballista. I'm just going to ping this once and pass the turn. Are they playing? Yeah, they're playing more than one survey land. They didn't want the dumping sphere. Okay. And they conceded. Nice. Last game. I have fun. You two. You like to play first? Yes, thanks. And we've got Labyrinth with nothing to pitch. We've got Forest. I think it's still a fine hand. Okay, turn one, we go tower, expedition map, your turn. Over from two. Light it up thing. So we're facing Yogmoth. I'm just going to play forest. Fetch four. Okay. Fetch four. A mine or a power plant. What else do you have? Another outling? Yeah, another outling, sure. I think I'm just going for a K command. You yeah, think so? But I'm going to wait. I want to see what they're up to. I don't want to excite just the whole thing. Okay, now we go for Scry Draw and Exile. I kind of need that, yeah. 
Next turn, we go Labyrinth, Micah Spawn, Dismember, the Yogmoth. We have Tron, and this should be kind of easy, I think. Hopefully. Ooh, Bozeju. We don't have any more basics. Yep. Oh, well, let's get rid of Yogmoth. I can still go Labyrinth, Ulamog, One Ring, so that's what I'm going to do. This deck feels so good. They only have three cards, we have one ring. Another dismember, that's good. Killed Goose. Chthonian Nightmare. That's interesting. So we kind of have to keep mana up to exile. Oh, they just did that. Sure. So I think I'm going to draw. Now we have Labyrinth, so that's four, six. Kind of... I'm not in an easy spot here. We have six mana. I could just excite their old graveyard and then make a bunch of 1-1s. One I think that that might be the right choice. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Because right now they're just going to play Chthonia Nightmare, Sacrifice Target, we exile their old graveyard, make a bunch of 1-1s, one of 0-1s. Then we have a lot of mana, we have something else. Oh well, let's go for that play anyway. Should I draw? No, I think I want mana. I'm going to take some. One, two, three. How much mana do you have? Four. Okay. So they have Cord. What could they have? Endurance. Yeah, they could Endurance back their cards in the deck. That's fine. I just don't want those cards in there. Ooh, they have Minator Mage. Yikes. And they have Chthonian Nightmare still. So I need another K command. Okay, there it is. Nice. So, what can I do? I kind of want to go Micah Spawn. 4, 6. We still have 2 mana. And then I play land. Yeah, okay. I could even... I mean, whatever. I don't need to actually go for the kicker. Let's get a power plant. And now... Okay, your turn. Minator Mage. That's annoying. Uh, sure. I'm just letting them... Target the Fulminator Mage first. I want to exile this one as well. Exile that one and we exile... I, I don't know if I'm targeting that or not. I cannot... Ah, boy. Let's cancel and do it again. I mean, it doesn't change if I target it or not. Makes no sense. Let's let's do it again. Wait. Okay, we want to go. We want to go for a K command. Exciting creature, exciting graveyard. We target that one and then we target one. Target two. And we target cord. I don't care. Now let's do it for two. Done. One, two, three. Okay. Innkeeper is their last card. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Phone your nightmare again. Okay, that's a magic card. But I'm going to do these get mine, play mine, putting back my beloved Ulamog. Okay, and they concede. Uh, I mean, maybe I'm just getting a flute. Stone Brain seems fine. Almost Crypt is not that great. Word Breaker out. And one Signet, maybe? I'm not too sure about this, but I want to try it. I think that every single card we have is not bad against them. I kind of want something to get my lands back. After they destroy them with Poseidon or uh, with Fulminator Mage, I want removal spells. I kind of need all this dust, this member. I think that this is something that I must keep. I also want a good card to end the game. So if I get to 8 mana, Ugin is just a win card. So yeah. Okay. Uh, sure, why not? I think it's fine. We don't have an answer to Fulminator Mage, but I think it's a good end. K Command is such a great card. It's kind of funny because I didn't think at first that it was that good. I mean, it was surely one of the best cards during spoiler season, but right now that I'm playing it, it's just really, really good. Oh, uh, yeah, sure, Innkeeper, not as scary. And now we just need to pray that they don't have Fulminator Mage. That treasure token is really cool. Earthing Ritual. Earthing Ritual. Thumping Sphere. Yeah, should I just kill the Innkeeper? 
I think it's just going to kill the innkeeper or whatever. I need like forest and Bozejo. We still have a couple good cards here. Uh, I think I'm just going for Elderati Temple, pass the turn. We have K Command and we have Expedition Map to get forest. Then I can go Mike Spawn and ramp up mana. Even Double Thought Not Seer might be good enough to win the game. Okay, okay, that's good. Uh, so I want to make a 1-1 one, one and exile target creature. Is these Orcish Bowmasters? Hopefully not. No, oh, that's just a Buzeju. Uh, yep, sure. So we do this. This is such a big mistake. Wow. Uh, now I'm getting Forest and I'm getting Buzeju. Maybe I'm going to top it properly. Yeah, we do this. Expedition Map. Buzeju. Uh, that was not a great plan, my friend. And your last card is Yogmo. Yeah, the game is over. Yeah, I'm going to say, the game is over. What can you do from this spot? Apprentice. Okay, you could get another Fulminator Mage, that's right, sure. But right now, I can just go for Buzeju, your Dumping Sphere. Do I even care about Dumping Sphere? I feel like I do, but the Birthing Ritual is so scary. I don't know, let's see. A Wire Might. Whatever. Okay, we go Buzeju. I'm going to Buzeju that one, and then we go for the Vower of Destiny on the Apprentice. Oh wow, it triggers also on Artifacts, that's cool, I didn't know that. Uh, yeah, I think I can attack, they're likely not going to block. Power Plant, the Vower of Destiny. This is such a cool card. Oh, I could have taken the Birthing Ritual. I, I, I'm dumb, but whatever. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe that was a mistake. <laughs> I, I think we are far, far, far ahead, but... Yeah, maybe taking Birthing Ritual would have been the right choice. I was saying that this card has such a cool name, though. Devourer of Destiny. It feels so powerful. And this was so dumb, though. Collector, oof. We get another power. Do we exile? No, a random land. I don't really care. What am I getting? Another one of these two, probably, because I want to play around them having a Fulminator Mage. We have so many big Eldzvazis into play, though. Yeah, we want Nice. So usually, I really despise this deck. I don't think it's really that funny to just loop one rings and have seven mana or more by turn three, but yeah, this league was kind of fun. We got to be the villain for once, and yeah, the deck is really, really powerful. I mean, K Command, amazing card, Devourer of Destiny is just really good to get the good cards on turn one. So nothing to say. I think that this list is just the best one I tried. I I tried a version without the forest and Buzeju, just a big colorless pile and I was not too impressed because you are just there to a random void mirror or a random Buzeju. So yeah, I think that this deck is better. It feels like this list is the perfect Tron list right now. So thanks again for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, share and follow me on Twitter and Moxville too. And see you in the next one.